<laughs> we are ready. And with that said, welcome back. Uh, today's video, we're jumping into the unboxing of our at least initial kit from Advanced Flight Systems. Um, so happy to have it here. I was really happy actually when the UPS driver rolled up. Um, she's an awesome delivery person. She was excited for us. She knew that it was something good and uh, it is. So um, goal with this video here is to unbox it all and not pronounce any part incorrectly, uh, which probably won't happen because I honestly don't know everything about what we ordered. All I know is it's what we need to have ordered to move forward, uh, which is, I guess, one of the great things with Advanced Flight Systems. Um, Kyle <laughs> and uh, Jennifer, the whole team there, everyone's been very uh, patient with me because I had quite a few changes along the way before finally hitting that order button. It was a big decision to make. So let's jump into it. Where's a knife? Don't cut the wires. All this right. Is, I think you need a close up of this. Why are know, we doing really so do far away? Up. iPhone close up. One sec. Plug it on the screen here. Wow. Ooh boy. There's stuff in there. And I have to take a quick pause. I have an offer out on a property and I just saw on my home screen, um, someone was talking about possibly having an accepted offer. So pausing for one second, we're gonna come back. Um, we gotta go pay for the airplane. We gotta, pay, we gotta pay for this stuff. One second. We're back. My buyer client is under contract as of 10 minutes ago. So just got off the phone with them. A, worth very, a worthwhile break. Yes, very, very happy for them. Great home, great terms. Anyways, back to unboxing this thing. And then there's some cold beer in there with our name on it. Yeah. Celebrate. I'm a little bit distracted, guys. He's really excited. Little, it was a really good... It was stressful. It was a good... Good negotiation. Good negotiation, which, by the way, I feel like you don't sell yourself, and since I'm on here, and blabbing. If you have anyone in the Phoenix, Scottsdale, Arizona area, refer them to Austin. I can attest to the fact... Yeah, he puts this up there as, like, a <laughs> casual, like, by the way, I'm an agent, but, and like... technically speaking... He is. This buyer client came from it my came. YouTube channel. It came, yeah, actually. They watch, so if you're watching this, <laughs> I'm not going to say your names, privacy. Thank so you, you this, for the thank referral. You. It's funny, I met with them, and they said that, that they uh, watched my YouTube videos before meeting in person. Yeah, so if and, anyone uh, else is in the area and needs an agent, Austin's your guy. Love to help you. Okay, back to unboxing. So I don't know how to do this efficiently. Um, on top here is documentation. I don't follow instructions. You guys already know that. <laughs> yes, you do. You know how many uh, leftover bolts I have? Stop. <laughs> no. Uh, so, looks like a full manual servo mounting kit. RV10, 7, and 8 roll for the right, right wing. Uh, so a roll servo. RG400. One side is terminated, the other side is not terminated. So heads up, I don't have that tool yet. I think I'm borrowing that tool from Clay. So thank you, Clay, for letting me borrow. I think I chatted on the phone yesterday about that. Um, but I'll probably end up borrowing his tool if he still has it. Check, check. Check, check. I'm just trust but verify. Okay, trust Reagan. Trust but verify. Um, part number 57861. This is a premium harness for the Control sticks, that really is kind of a hard angle for that camera. I'm gonna zoom this in. Hopefully we look good on camera tonight. Uh, there we go. Uh, control stick, pre-made harnesses. I have one for co-pilot, one for pilot. Five, seven. That is nice. Uh, ACM connector kit, part number 57250. Um, so it's a quick panel connector kit. So yeah, comes with a pin removal tool. Uh, but I do know that I'm going to need a crimping tool for these connections as well. Put that in a future video. RV10, RV14, yaw servo kit. Yaw. Yeah. Yaw. Yeah. Uh, tiller arm bow kit for RV10, 14. Servo mounting kit, RV10 pitch. It's a pitch servo. Right there. Skyview network cable, 20 feet. Flow, fuel flow sensor assembly. Yep, that's it. So I kind of bought this a little bit early. I am relocating mine forward of the firewall. I'll do that on a future video. After talking with a couple of other builders, that was the general consensus. So when I installed my uh, fuel lines from Aircraft Specialties, I keep forgetting the name, but when I installed my braided fuel lines, I did do the option for relocating the red cube further forward, forward of the firewall. Um, various reasons, you can research it online, but I really don't need this now, um, but we have it for the future. Sensor package, Lycoming Continental Superior six-cylinder fuel-injected 
Pressure sensors, V2. Sounds fake. Inside of that engine kit, we have, so these are EGT sensors, six of them. All right, CHT, EGT sensors. One, two, three, four, five, six, four, four, five, and six. Two of the oil, oil fuel, fuel fluid pressure sensors. Got it. Map sensor. Got it. I'm gonna zoom this back in so you can see actually what is in these baggies. Um, engine sensor main wiring harness. Engine sensor that is main so satisfying. wiring harness. That is beautiful. Oil temperature sensor. Oil temperature sensor. Amp shunt. Shunt. EGT CHT wiring harness. Six cylinder. Six feet long. Six feet long. If you're curious about the wires, even down to the individual labeling, it's just so neat. And we are running out of room and I don't want stuff to fall. So you're gonna start seeing stuff disappear from the top of the workbench, which is out of frame anyway, so you don't care. People write in the comments, we actually care. We care, <laughs> we wanted that in view. How dare. This is another heavy as heck bag of wiring. Gosh, I'm so happy I'm not doing all this wiring on my own. I couldn't imagine. I could not. Also, Look at that. every single one of these, uh, whatever we call it, looms of wires, I have no clue. Every single one of them has its own wiring diagram associated with it. That is so cool. That is awesome. Um, RV10 airframes. This is the airframe wiring kit. Multiple. Inside of the package with multiple wires. We have number one, we have a RV10 wing harness. Wing harness so, RV10 right here. Wiring diagram already with it and okay. all of the wiring uh, with I assume one side terminated. Trim Flap harness. and trim harness. Got it. Again, I love this. Wiring diagrams. RV10 front aircraft harness. Aircraft front harness RV10. Check. RV10 rear wiring harness. ACM Autopilot Servo Harness. ACM Autopilot Servo and By the harness. way, the documentation here is folded. It's not this small. It looks like it folds out to a, a large sheet. Back in the baggie. All of our wiring. That is just so satisfying. <laughs> That's my wife. She's nice. <laughs> Don't be quiet. <laughs> Heated AOA and pedo probe. This is exciting because uh, now I can get the wings closed up. This is a big component on those bottom skins. I don't really want to open the whole thing up right now. It's just too exciting to not open all the way. Oh my gosh! Uh, yeah! <laughs> Cut that. That's impressive. <laughs> That's our thumbnail. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> That's for sure our thumbnail. <laughs> we have an SV42T linear actuator. SV. Let's see what it is. She's pretty. Yeah, she's really pretty. That is a beefy servo. Cool. So two SV42 output arms. I'm gonna open up one for you because uh, they're the same thing it looks like. More servos. All right, you got both of those? Yep. We got a SV ADSB 472 for our ADSB antenna. I'm assuming. Uh, pedo mount brackets. Cool. All right, I've got another white box. They love white boxes over at Dynon and Advanced Flight Systems. Um, Adhars, SV80HRS-200. Adhars. I went with a single Adhars unit. I know they offer two. My plan right now with our panel is we'll end up having one Dynon Adhars unit. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Uh, then we're going to be using a backup G5, Garmin G5 as our, um, as our backup attitude, uh, which will have its own um, internal Adahars, is my understanding. Oh, and the uh, outside air temperature probe comes with that kit. Another white box, uh, GPS, SV GPS 250, Dynon GPS antenna. 
Dine on GPS antenna. Do you know how many times I'm not going to include it? <laughs> I tried recording that in different ways, but my brain was either behind or in front of my mouth. Don't know which one. Another white box uh, SV EMS 220. I don't know what that is. So this connects to the flux capacitor. That's fake. That's not a real thing. No. One zero nine. Oh, is this for the engine monitor? Yeah. Or cool. it's engine monitoring module. Cool. Emergency locator transmitter. Pedostatic AOA. It's a pedo installation kit. I thought we already had enough. Oh, this is all the tubing for the uh, pedostatic kit. So different colors of my guess is nylon or some kind of tubing that's used for the pedostatic system. A uh, whole bunch of looks like a pack of connectors, different tools for it, and uh, yeah, pedostatic kit. Uh, another white box. And um, this is actually the antenna for our uh, GPS navigator that we plan on using. Yay. This was one of those things that I ordered separately. It wasn't gonna originally come with the kit. My understanding is it comes with the navigator that you purchased. So I'm using an Avidyne GPS navigator. I plan on having one panel, not ordered it yet, but it comes as a kit. Uh, I didn't wanna have to wait until I had that navigator because I wanna be able to actually get this installed, this GPS antenna installed in the tail cone. Um, that way, of course, I don't have to climb through a completed uh, AC system and all that stuff. So anyways, it's a Rami GPS antenna. Bingo. Got them all. You got them. So that first one we missed was the drawings. Panel drawings package. Fantastic. Cool. We have it all here. They were honest people. They shipped us everything. As um, expected. All right, that's everything. We got everything on the list. Austin unpacked most of it. There's a lot to learn on all these. We unpacked it, but that does not mean we understand everything. So that is next step. Yeah, learning so what I all will this be is. filming a whole lot of content for this. Um, oh, yeah. Getting all this stuff installed. So subscribe, follow along. Give me a like if you like the video. And uh, yeah, if you have comments, questions, concerns, feedback, or you just want to say hi, say hi down in the comments down below. And we'll see you in that next video. Adios. Hasta luego. <laughs> That's me, my sign off. <laughs>